Welcome to our broadcast of the 55th Annual O'Bion County Fair with your host, Blake Laws, LaShonda Cook, and many more. Stay tuned for a look at the sights and sounds of the fair. On Wednesday, don't miss the Junior and Open Swine Show, Stick Horse Rodeo in the Livestock Barn, Mud Racing in the Outdoor Arena, Championship Wrestling at the Grandstand, two performances of the Fair Show Musical in the Whitney Cozart Pavilion, plus Back Porch Stage Entertainment, Barney Five in Person, and Steel Magnolia Live in Concert Thursday, August 15th at 8 o'clock. Clock. Come out and enjoy every night of the 55th Annual O'Bion County Fair. Welcome to the 55th Annual O'Bion County Fair. I am Blake Laws. And I'm LaShonda Cook. It's Wednesday night here at the fair. Lots of things going on, and we're going to tell you just a little bit about what's going on. That way, if you want to come out and join us, which we encourage you to do so, uh, then you'll know exactly what's going on here at the fair. So I got to catch the first show of the Fair Show musical last night at the fair. Um, it showed at 9 o'clock last night, but the rest of the week it'll have two showings at 7 and 9 p.m. I encourage you to come out and watch that. It was an awesome show. It was one of the best ones I've seen, and I think I've probably seen every one they've had. Mm -hmm. So they, they obviously have practiced a lot on that. So they did a really good job. And like she said, 7 and 9 p.m. for the rest of the week. And uh, come on out. These kids have worked uh, long hours. They've worked really hard uh, to put together a show uh, for you during the fair. Yeah. And I also saw Barney Five here tonight <laughs> walking around, giving people tickets. He uh, said hi to me as I walked through the gate and looked just like Barney Five. I thought, wow. <laughs> <laughs> I was amazed at how much like Barney Five he actually looks like. Mm -hmm. So he, uh, he had a big crowd around him. So he'll be here the rest of the week as well. Mm -hmm. So come out and see him also. It's an experience to say the least. We've got mud racing. That's the big event. It's uh, a new event here. Uh, we added uh, this year. And we also have championship wrestling. Uh, at the grandstand and then of course tonight is sponsored by Green Plains and they are located in O'Bion. Yeah. So I didn't participate in the mud wrestling but I walked <laughs> in the mud all weekend so um, wear your boots if you come to the fair but don't let that stop you because there is so much going on at the fair. There's lots of concrete paths around as well if you want to stay out of the mud or, or wear your boots and trample in the mud. Mm -hmm. Um, so we've got mud wrestling and, uh, no, we don't have mud wrestling. We, <laughs> we got mud, mud racing, racing and then we have yeah. wrestling, right? <laughs> Two separate things. We're not wrestling Two separate in the things, mud. yeah. But, uh, anyway, we also have <laughs> two performances of the Fair Show Musical at 7 and 9 p.m. Yeah. Uh, we have some, uh, back porch stage entertainment, which is going to be the 2013, uh, West Tennessee Idol winner. And she is from around Jackson and she will be here. Uh, later on, and she will be uh, performing uh, probably about an hour and 30 minute show. Wow, okay. So, of course, at the end of the night, we're going to finish the night off with a $1,000 drawing at 10 p.m. That will be at the grandstand. Um, if no draw, no winner is selected, then 500 of that will carry over to the next night. That's correct. Uh -huh. That's right. And they'll give away $500. Uh, tonight if the first ticket drawn uh, doesn't have a winner. So they'll continue to draw until there is a winner of at least the $500. Right. right. Mm -hmm. okay. All right, and then let's go ahead and talk about uh, Thursday while we're at it. Tomorrow, uh, tomorrow, uh, Senior Citizens Day here at the fair. Uh, all the senior citizens from the local area will come out. Uh, we will have uh, First Citizens National Bank as our sponsor of the day. Uh, the folks from the bank there will come out and uh, cook hamburgers and all the fixings and they'll have them uh up there at the uh church sun sweat baptist church and also here on the fairgrounds yeah. and it's also a ten dollar admission night you pay ten dollars to get in and you can ride all night um despite the rain and the mud the rides are going on there's kids standing in line and having lots of fun as you walk around the carnival so the rides are still going ten dollars and you can get in you can also watch the uh junior open and beef show that starts at 6 p.m and of course we'll have music on the back porch stage again mm -hmm. as well tomorrow night and you gotta come see the fair musical seven and nine mm -hmm. p.m and then we uh wrap up thursday night with the uh, $1,000 drawing. And of course, we can't leave out at 8 o'clock the Steel Magnolia concert. That's right, yeah. Yeah, they'll be here. Um, the concert will actually take place the same place as the drawing. So once you're there to watch the concert, just stay seated and maybe you'll be a lucky winner of the $1,000. Mm -hmm. And that's what's going on on Thursday. And again, our sponsor of Thursday is First Citizens 
National Bank. We're going to take a short break, and we will be back here in just a few moments. Hi, my name is Danielle Murray. I work with Green Plains Abine. This is Lisa Johnson. We are located in Reeves, Tennessee. We are there at the Knoll plant. Um, a little bit about our process. We take corn and we break it down to, uh, we produce feed, ethanol, uh, along with corn syrup, uh, corn oil. Uh, we employ roughly around 50 people. And uh, we do, we have temporary people that work with us as well. Um, we bring in corn from local farmers and granaries. Um, just try to help the supply and the people of Auburn County. And um, our ethanol trucks, they come in, they, uh, they fill up 24-7. Uh, they pick up the ethanol, they take it to other distributors um that provide uh fuel they mix it together um we have of course like i said we have feed we uh dry feed wet feed and um, i know that we sell to uh companies such as tyson pilgrims we are uh, green plains so green plains and we are the sponsor for the bond county fair on wednesday so come by and see our booth Come celebrate Barnes Boots and Country Roots at the 2013 O'Brien County Fair, continuing now through Saturday, August 17th. Exciting events include beauty pageants, livestock shows, truck and tractor pull, mud racing, demolition derby, and steel magnolia live in concert, plus Myers International Midways. Get your season tickets at the fair office. Also get entry forms at the fair office or at obioncountyfair.net. The O'Brien County Fair, starting Monday, August 12th at the O'Brien County Fairgrounds. And we want to welcome you back here to the O'Brien County Fair. Going to talk to you now about Friday's events. Now, Friday, uh, things will be really loud here at the fair <laughs> as we uh, have our truck and tractor pull. And that starts at 7 o'clock uh, right here behind us at the uh, grandstand. Yeah, and Friday's uh, day at the fair is sponsored by Woods Communication. And we appreciate their sponsorship. They have been faithful as a sponsorship for the fair for many years mm -hmm. now. Um, so we appreciate uh, their assistance in making Friday a success. If you don't like the loud noise from the truck and tractor pull, come on over and watch the fair show. Or um, Also, you can watch the Junior Open Beef Show. will be that same night, Friday night. And, of course, don't forget, we do have music on the back porch stage starting at 7 o'clock. And then... Uh, at 10 o'clock, we do have the $1,000 nightly drawing, which will uh, be uh, at the grandstand. So the truck and tractor pull is uh, sure to draw a crowd. Mm -hmm. It always, always does. Always does. Always does. Mm -hmm. And Woods Communication, uh, they are the sponsor of the day, and they are a major sponsor in our truck and tractor pull. On Saturday, events get started early at 9 a.m. with the pet show, followed by the mule show in the livestock barn. And then we have the garden tractor pull, and that starts at noon on Saturday. That's right. And there will also be a breeding sheep show, and from 2 to 6 p.m. will be Kids Day. It's free admission for children that come in from 2 to 6 p.m. that day. Uh, Kids Day is sponsored by Union City Coke. They have a booth set up here. Uh, if you come through the main entrance of the gate uh, for the fair, you can go by Union City Coke and get, get a little sample of Coke. Mm-hmm. And we want to thank them for sponsoring Kids Day. They're always uh, very faithful uh, to sponsor Kids Day each year. Right. And then at 3 p.m., there will be two bicycles given away, one girl bicycle and one for a boy. Right, right. Mm -hmm. And that will take place at the Whitney Cozart Pavilion. That's now, right. you can sign up. They usually start signing up about 30 minutes prior, so about 2.30. And then at 3 o'clock, they'll give away the bicycles. So then at 5 o'clock, on Saturday is when the main fair gates open for just the general public. Mm -hmm. um, Kids Day is over. We have a new sponsor, um, Johnson Heating and Air. They actually sponsor the entire day and into the night. Right. Um, mm -hmm. So at 5 p.m., the, the gates will open up, and the Wool and Woolies review will start then, uh, followed by the Market Lamb and Commercial U Show at 6. Mm -hmm. And then uh, also at 6, we have uh, Back Porch Stage Entertainment, followed by uh, the Demolition Derby at 7 o'clock, and that will take place in the outdoor arena. That's a very big event. It's kind of like the uh, last big event of the week. <laughs> the so come on out and uh, join us for that. Yeah, 
and that will draw a big crowd as well. Mm -hmm, it will. The tractor pull and the demolition derby draws a huge crowd at the fair um, to the point that there's no sitting room left and they are standing on top of standing on top of things. <laughs> so <laughs> if you want to see those two events and you'll need to come on out, come a little early, get you a corn dog, uh, find you a good place to sit in the stands and enjoy the show. And don't forget uh, the last two performances of the uh, Whitney Cozart Pavilion musical. The Fair Show musical uh, will be at 7 and 9 p.m. Yeah. Um, and it'll be your last opportunity to win $1,000, which possibly could be 1500 if there's no winner from the night before. Um, so you'll want to stay till 10 p.m. and come back to the main grandstand area for that drawing uh, to see if you might be the winner of that money. Mm-hmm. And that will be, the, of course, the last drawing of the week. Uh, so come on out and join us all day for uh, Saturday, Kids Day, followed by uh, the Demolition Derby that night. Yeah. It's going to be a big day. The weather is going to be great from what I can tell. Uh, hopefully the rain has gone and will stay gone <laughs> until the week's over with. And uh, I think the uh, temperatures will be in the... Mid, high 70s, uh, yeah, mid, mid to 70s. high 70s, uh -huh. sunny. Uh, it's going to be perfect weather to come out to the fair. Mm -hmm. Perfect. And we uh, we definitely encourage you to come on out and join us. Uh, come walk through the exhibit buildings, uh, the junior exhibits building, the domestic arts building, and even uh, in the open building where the yeah. commercial exhibitors are set up. So come on out and see everything here at the fair. And that's going to wrap up tonight's show. Uh, we do thank you for joining us, and we hope to see you tomorrow night. Thank you for being a part of our broadcast of the 55th Annual O'Bion County Fair with your host, Blake Laws, LaShonda Cook, and many more. Be sure to come out every night for rides, games, food, and family fun going on now through Saturday, August 17th. On Thursday, events include Senior Citizens and Special Needs Day with free admission until 5, Junior and Open Beef Show in the Livestock Barn, Steel Magnolia and Concert on the Real Foot Bank Stage, two performances of the Fair Show Musical in the Whitney Cozart Pavilion, plus Back Porch Stage Entertainment and Barney Five Live in Person. Come out and enjoy every night of the 55th Annual O'Bion County Fair.